Hello, all. And just look at your monitor right now. All of us ready to go. Except Anna, too fucking fist in it. What? She's always got some kind of bottle of water, water or some bullshit. I can't have water? Yes, Papa, you can. Just maybe keep it off camera. Looks better when you get your area clean. Oh, well, then there's Lummy with his trapper keeper. Lummy's eating food because he doesn't feel good. Oh, Lummy, hold on, you, Lummy, you don't feel good, buddy. I'm, I'm good now. Let's break that, it down, he buddy. Was, he was hungry. He needed. Go he suck needed yourself some, twenty dollars cash. Ooh, what where, you where at? Go, go shuck yourself twenty cash. Where? Facebook uh, or YouTube? YouTube. YouTube. <clears throat> you got to kind of denote. Sorry, twenty dollars you know kiz ash. No, oh, twenty dollars cash slash YouTube. YouTube. Sorry. Pick it up from the top, kid. Go shuck yourself twenty dollars cash. YouTube. Do you need a moment to chew? I don't think you can. Can you can't do cash on Facebook, right? No, just, I think it's just stars. Just stars, okay. <clears throat> Which, Anna, how's how's the Luberderm on the hands doing? Good. It's Jergens and it's good. I need it. My hands get gross because I wash them so much. They get dry. God, you just need to be thrown around a little bit. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. That's gonna cure my dry hands. No, I think it's just gonna cure you. Everything. Mm. I think about that sometimes. You're just kind of getting thrown around a little bit. Just kind of like I don't even know if I know how man, to do like it just, anymore. Just, just, and and I'm not going to make the show what you need to do, okay, bitch? But like, I like I like I like talking about it because I feel as if one of these days we're going to sink through. Like something's going to rest. One of our many, one one of our many, see there, and that's a progress in itself. Yeah, you probably wouldn't have gotten nails, never, ever. Like if you know when you were on Johnny B show, and he's like, hey, hey, you know, maybe she gets a nail. You're like, fuck you, John. Well, you can't even say that on the air, but I'm saying like, I'm not, (laughs) I'm not getting nails. I like to bite them. Yeah. Now we got you getting nails. Yep, I'm getting them today. Baby steps. Yep, step by step, day by day. So I'm just saying, like I. Lummy, are you puking? No. no. What? Because you were bending down. Like, I'm just, I'm very, I'm very. Uh, Don't forget, too, you're like a, a minute delay. delayed. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. In, in I took life. My pen. Not, not just on this feed, in life. Yeah, these, because remember, like, Twitch is like five or six seconds, but Facebook and YouTube is like a minute. Yeah. Let me see that. I'm going to go over to the, I usually like to stay on Facebook because it's the underdog. Facebook is kind of the underdog. Yeah, There's 279 on YouTube. Right 114 now. on Facebook. <laughs> yeah. Facebook is kind of the underdog. Mm hmm. YouTube's kind of the big slinging dick. Let's just be honest. Hold on here. Boom. 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 I got to get the feed for the YouTube. Make sure we have them both. I can toggle back and forth. I can whore, if you will, be a little bit of a whore. Whore it out. Oh, there we go. Same feed on both, right? But it's just yes. different chat people. Correct. And 133 on Facebook, and it looks like a whopping... 296 on YouTube. Nearly 300 on YouTube. We do all of our after, all of our Wednesdays and Thursdays after shows now exclusively uh, as a double platform, double penetration. And uh, we're doing quite brisk. Branding Dunning, $10 cash, YouTube. <laughs> so <clears throat> did you get like hypoglycemic today? Like, did you get like... Me or... No, him. Yeah, me, me, yeah, I think so. Blitz, uh, what does high... Doesn't that mean like your blood sugar's low? Hypoglycemic or something like that. That means yellow. Yep. Hyperglycemic. Hyper would, would be, be high. high. Yeah, I was no, but I'm low. thinking you were low. I think I, I'm. I'm thinking that you were low and you were. Did you eat anything all morning, buddy? I had a. I. I. I had a banana. Are you back? Are you back to regular food now? Or are you still on softs? I can eat uh, like plain chicken and meat and stuff like that and soups. Though. Well, I gotta think all that's pretty much just normal then, isn't it? I mean, so what were you eating just now? Uh, chicken breast. Oh, nice. Chicken breast from chicken Blitz titty? or no? Your... I I uh, ordered it from Chick Fil A. Now, how had he asked me? I have an extra one. I would, I, and I offered it to him. He said I already ordered food. Yeah. Heather Wiz says all the hot girls. It, it, you know what, Blitz? I'm going to be honest with you. There's like, like that Danielle girl. She's over here on Facebook, and Wizzy's over here on Facebook. Oh, okay. There's like, I mean, I can't believe you can't figure it out. Like the hotter, there's like the, the, there's some hot bitches over here on Facebook. <laughs> I need to move over then. I'm watching on I'm watching YouTube. Yeah, uh, I think Country Girl is on Facebook. Yeah, she is. Look at that. I got that I got that Danielle girl. Mm-hmm. I got the uh Ren, I got, you know, Country Girl and Wizzy. I mean, what that's the ultimate threesome right there. Yeah. Uh, I'm watching us. So anyway, we do double platform on Wednesdays and Thursdays. We do uh 
Facebook and YouTube. And I really and we're really getting some great numbers on Facebook where we've qualified for certain things. But I'm going to be honest with you, it's really tough to figure out. Their back end is tough. It's almost too much. Like like Blitz, you would agree you know, you're Johnny fucking hard drive there. You're Johnny Yep. You're you know, you're by all by most people's standards, you're very te- you're very technical with computers, right? Uh, I don't like to toot my own horn. But oh, quit I- being a fuck. When it comes to guns, when it comes no, no, no. to having a big dick, when it comes to taking pictures of yourself in the shower, and it comes to fucking computers, Blitz, you're at the top of my list. Oh yeah, I'll, I was actually going to say, as far as computers go, probably more than almost everybody. Yeah, like you're. Yeah. You're pretty fucking handy with computers. Yeah, yeah. And even you have come to me and been like, man, Facebook's backhand is a fucking handful. Mm -hmm. And we're trying to figure out the Facebook backend. I'm also looking for a tractor. Did I tell you that? How big? How big a tractor? I'm looking for a four wheel drive, 75 to 100 horsepower PTO. I don't need any attachments. I don't need no fucking scoop on the front. I just need it so bad. I got a bunch of people bird dogging as well for it. Blitz, we can't tell anybody about my new purchase. Oh, okay. But what do you think about it? I mean, it sounds badass. Oh. Is it something I'd like? Um, Hold on. Yes. Well, is, is it something I like? Blitz, don't, don't. Blitz, Blitz, let me just put you, let me just answer it this way. Okay. If I had that when she was at my track and she could have gone hanging out there well it would have been a far better experience for wait, here's what i was going to say hands? hold on here's what i was going to say don't say anything but she knows what it is oh i know what it is i'm sorry i yeah. won't say anything oh uh, i'm the only one you don't know you, I, I don't know yeah you, you uh, showed she it saw to me, it. she saw it yesterday i yeah. forgot now yeah, i know yeah. what you're talking yeah, about yeah, yeah, but yeah, but listen, and it's not because i don't want you to know i just haven't seen you but i'll show you buddy oh, yeah, no like, it's not well, a fucking yeah. secret me, me, me and bubba were talking about it and i she look walked good in. as fuck well, of course she walked in and so he showed her i look good as fuck you do i like you with the glasses <clears throat> yeah Tyler well, just said i don't even know about it oh me and tyler oh tyler does yes he does he knows about it like a rugged anderson cooper i haven't heard Oh. Wait till I, I I missed the gym all week this he week. Kn- he said he knows about it, but and I said I don't feel g- I did not get to the gym this week near like I wanted to. But if I would have, man, I'd be swoed right to fuck now. Well, uh, I don't, I couldn't tell. Hey, hey, um, uh, hey, uh, Jesus, you over there? <clears throat> you need to get that air compressor and fill up that left rear on your car if you on your race car if you can. Okay. Just put enough in so it ain't crinkling, you know. Okay. okay. And then we'll and then we'll sw- and th- we're gonna obviously check it when we get to the track. Yeah. Is I mean, the weather report not looking good? Um. You know, it looks fucking horrible. Oh. It's it's sixty percent Friday and Saturday, so it's <laughs> still not good. And it's supposed to rain this afternoon, like four to eight. It's so. just and it, and I was up in Ocala yesterday. Me and One Eyed Billy were on the track, and I'm on the fucking grader, and I'm getting stuck, and I'm. Trying to bring all the fucking material that's in the X up, and it's just an absolute fucking mess. We're trying our best. The more foot, the more traffic I can get on. The more I can get the grader on the track, the more I can kind of pack it down so I can start to clip it. And then out of nowhere, this absolute fucking monsoon Gully comes. Washer. You just fuck like a seven minute fucking Noah's Ark flood and shit. Mm. And I was just like, and it just completely ruins everything that you've done for the three hours that you've worked the track it just fucks everything up so whatever owning a dirt track it dirt track on the most isn't florida like the third rainiest state in america doug Uh, clem knows it rained so much that he fucking ribbed me on it he did yeah when last week oh i'm I'm at the track and he's like uh how's tyler doing and I'm like, he, he he got rained out, and he goes, man, you guys in Florida, it's probably tough to be a real good race car driver in Florida. That's why all the good race car drivers come from the West, California. I go, well, Dad, how about Mario Andretti and A.J. Foyt and Tony Stewart? And, 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 and we kind of got in a little bit of, you know. Mm-hmm. Florida's in the top five. Again, let me, is this the second rainiest July, August on record? Yeah, since 1963. It's over eight inches. Jesus, God. 
Are you? Aren't you guys tired? I mean, I hate to be an old fucking timer, but aren't you tired of rain? Yes. I can't fucking take it any longer. Anna, does rain piss you off too? Sometimes, yes. Like when I have something planned outside or I want to party, but sometimes I like it if it's just I don't feel like doing anything, and then the well, rain comes. Well, that's if you and... got a guy that's there at that. Like, who wants to be by themselves when it rains? Me. For real? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, because then if it's like, oh, I didn't do anything today, but it was raining, so it's supposed to be an indoor day. Yeah, you have a good excuse. Yeah, but isn't yeah. Ra- but raining is for having a crick. Yeah, and, it's nice to have a boy crick. Yeah, yeah. like, you you know, you your cricks are men and my cricks are women. Exactly. So you got a crick up and in the s- cut. You got a crick caper going and on. And you snuggle. And, and you, you Netflix it. You Yellowstone it. And then you do a little fucking. A little fucking, a little eating, a little napping. Yeah, there you mm. go. That should be your new country song. What's that again? A little fucking, a little eating, a little napping. A little getting high. A little getting high. You got a balcony on your on your on, on your. I have like a little patio. I wouldn't call it a balcony, but well, I mean, is it? Are you on the first floor or second floor? Second. Well, then you have a balcony. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it seems could, like... I mean, <laughs> a patio up more than one story is called a balcony. Yeah. I know, but it just. I mean, you could know. you and I fit on it? Yes. Could you and I sit on a lawn chair, not on the same, but in different lawn chairs? Could you and I sit on your patio on a lawn chair, my lawn chair, your lawn chair? Uh, is it the elongated lawn chair? No, it's like... just a little, it's just like a, a chair chair. It, yeah, yeah. Well, yes. then you got a fucking balcony. I got a balcony. Could you put a gas grill out there? Mm, uh, it'd be a tight squeeze, probably not. Would they let you? Yeah, sometimes they don't let you because no, you're fucking blowing there, we up. Have, we have a grill by the pool that people use that yeah. I've never even touched. <clears throat> See, that's bullshit. What? That's why I can never live in an apartment. Oh, Blitz, did I tell you? I might be looking for an apartment. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. You want to be my neighbor? Reagan's no. moving out, so maybe we could be roomies. No. Wh- I'm way too... I think that'd be a great idea. I think that'd like, be great. Like That's... Tyler will tell you, I'm like really stuck on my ways. Like I like me sh- too. I like my shit a certain way. Me too. Plus Tyler lives and, with me. And good news, Bubba, you guys would be able to share one bathroom. <laughs> Fuck that, <laughs> Tyler. And I'm a long shitter. Like I take fi- I take fifteen to twenty. You know, I take fifteen yeah. or twenty minute shits. And Anna shits like fifteen times a day, so psh, that Dude. bathroom be used nonstop. <laughs> yeah, like if I was in there shitting and you had to go. I'd be like, listen, I just got in here, and you know before I moved in, I told you I take 50, you can set a timer to it, I take 15-minute shits. I'm playing my game, bitch, I'm you'll playing, come back later. And I get in there, and I play my soccer game. Yeah. Is Tyler a long shitter, too? Because he's going to live there. I don't think Tyler's, Tyler, are you a long shitter? I mean, probably like 10 minutes at max. So then you got my long shitting gene. Yeah. That's long? Ten minutes. There's, you know what? There are some people that literally go in there, poop, and get out of there as fast as they can. <laughs> I'm like, what the what, fuck? What is... a bunch of fucking weirdos. Yeah, yeah. you're I in mean, there for like twenty minutes. Yeah, twenty, thirty sometimes. Yeah, don't your legs go numb? Yeah. Sometimes. Sometimes I've. You got to stamp it out. Yeah. Sometimes I've <laughs> gone part to... of a black fraternity. Sometimes... All of a sudden. Hold on. <laughs> I see stop. the funky shingling <laughs> to get fucking <laughs> circulation back in my fucking quadriceps. No, but like there's been some times where I'm shitting and I go to wipe and I wipe and then I go to get up and I kind of like. It feels little, like there's something coming again. You're like, you're like a baby deer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're like a baby or, or like, deer. Or those baby giraffes. Yeah, when they first come out of their mom's sniz. Can't fucking stand and, and up they're, And they're like. Ugh. You ever notice how those baby giraffes, they come right out of their mom's big giraffe pussy. And it only <laughs> takes them for like, it only takes them like. Three or four minutes yeah, to like, get their bearings. Yeah, five minutes and they're an adult. Yeah, five minutes, man. Yeah, they got to, otherwise they're going to be eaten and by a like, predator. Well, no. First of all, what? giraffes are some badass motherfuckers. Yeah. They can fight lions. They got the big... Not with their babies. No, but they'll protect their baby. Not everybody abandons people like you do. Yeah. yeah. In the wild... You're an abandoner. In the, yeah. in the wild... <laughs> In the wild, the mom stays there and fights like a motherfucker for yeah, everybody. I, I, I know, but the baby gets up and the baby is walking within minutes of birth. I know. Can Who you imagine if said? kids? Yeah. Can you imagine if kids were like that? That's what I'm saying. Your, kids are like that. Your mom pops you out of her sniz and you're just you get your bearings about yourself, and next thing you know, you're fucking walking. Yeah, it takes humans like a fucking year to even take a step. So oh. that's what I'm saying is like there's a big difference. Nobody even knows this, and I don't even know if I'm supposed to be saying this because it's kind of making Jesus look bad. But Fred Cruz, a thousand stars, Facebook. Tyler, did you know? that me and your mom had to take you to walking rehab. I remember that. Yeah, you told me about that recently. Yeah, like Tyler like wouldn't walk. He couldn't walk. 
and and because he developed my fucking stupid gene, but but I'm saying like, <laughs> and so and so like we, we took him to the doctor, me and his mom, when we had shared custody, mm -hmm. and they're like, well, he should be walking by now, and Tyler was like, fuck this walking, I rather yeah, but he ain't walking, fix him, and so we had to take him down to this fucking little rehab place. And they had to, like, you know, they like... They put braces on his legs like Forrest Gump? No, they didn't put braces on his legs like Forrest Gump. And we could have, you know, Blitz, we could have very well Tyler, done... Run, run! We could have very well, if they just would have showed us, how, we could have done it at home. Oh, like I know. you, I mean, you could have, but Nowadays I only think you. Was it like YouTube physio? wasn't around in yeah. O2. YouTube wasn't around in O2, so you literally had to go to the fucking doctors. And I had great insurance. I had unbelievable insurance. Yeah, thanks. And Tom. they're and and they're like the tree man. Yeah, thanks, Tom, the tree man. I had unbelievable insurance. I was with, I was with Clear Channel at the time, Blitz. Oh, even better. So I had Clear Channel fucking yippee yo. Yeah. <clears throat> and so they're like, man, your kid. So we were taking Tyler down there like three times a week, and they were just basically just going. Bee, 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 bee. Like, I could have done All you had to do was put a fucking balloon on the other side of the room. He would have ran to it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, but Tyler, you were a late walker. Hey, if it makes Tyler feel any better, my mom took me to the doctor because I was pigeon-toed. Well, well, it didn't work. Didn't do no, anything. it didn't work. It didn't work. But I, I, I bamboozled the doctor. I made the doctor think that my mom was crazy. They told, they told me to walk across the hall, and I was very careful. Not to pigeon-toe it out? Correct. And they're like, I don't see a problem. And my mom was like, this fucking bitch. Was walking like a no, Ashley. I don't have a squatty potty. I had one, and I didn't Did like you it. Tip over? No, I. You what? know the squatty potties. It's where you put your leg. You elevate yeah. your legs yeah. while it's you're it's shitting. All, it's and it's all back. It's all it's, back. And it's, I know what it is. And it's supposed to like open up your asshole. Yeah. So you can get, <laughs> no. That's what it's supposed. Right. It's supposed to like elongate your asshole. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that you can get you know. Well, first of all, if it straightens out your shit tube. Well, I'm just telling you. Yeah. It. It. it Basically, my shit tube's fine. I got a lot of miles on my ship tube. And I don't got the lummy type of miles on my shit tube. I got going out miles. Okay? My my tide my tide's going, going out. Miles. My tide's going out. You don't have an you don't have an Evan flow? No. I don't, I don't you have, just have a, a flow. You have no ebb. My tide doesn't go in and out. I don't have high tide or low tide. My ship my tide's always going you know, oh, high tide all the time. You're not, you're not a beach, you're a river. Yes. Okay. I am the motherfucking Mississippi. I'm flowing south at all times. Lummy is like whatever that fucking river is that goes opposite. Is it the Nile? Yeah. Remember there's one river like in the Anaconda or something? The Congo? That, that, that goes one it has a reverse current or yeah, whatever? Yeah, that's what Lummy is. You so, no, know. I listen, Ashley. Uh, by the way, all the hot chicks, I mean, Have squatty I, I hate to fucking ruin the YouTube party, but there's a lot of hot chicks on the fucking Facebook feed. That's where the chicks go. I need to get on the fucking Facebook. No, page. stay off my fucking feet. I found I'm on there. I'm going to talk to these chicks. I got, what up, I ladies? had an Ashley girl. I got country girl. I got Wizzy. I got Ooh, the I Danielle like... girl. I mean, I got, I got oh. five or six hotties right now. I'm all juggling on my Facebook. Juggling all these jugs. I'm juggling all these fucking cricks. Hmm. I, I got a, I got a crock pot, crock pot full of cricks over here. Uh, on my on my Facebook deal, you t you YouTubers just stay the fuck over there. Get off yeah. my f get off. I got Denise on here. What up, Denise? How you doing? <clears throat> so I forget. Oh no. So squatty potty. Hey, hi. What's up, Wizzy? Squatty potties are made to like elevate your 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 feet. Oh you know, right. To straighten out your shit tube. Mm -hmm. But yeah. my my shit tube is very healthy. Very healthy. I take nice shits. Your shit tube has no problem going around corners a little bit. What do you mean? Well, well if you don't have if if you don't have a, a squatty potty, then your shit tube's a little bent, and yeah. your your shit has no problem going around corners. Yeah, kind of like they can corner like a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, my, like a race car. Yeah, like a road course driver. Yeah, I got like a fucking. You got a NASCAR shit tube. I got like an F one fucking shit tube. Yeah, yeah. I'm, it can take like four or five G's going no, around the fucking. No, I got no, Lewis. No, I got no. Lewis Hamilton driving my shit tube. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got no no lifting. Yeah, you got a. Yeah, dare I got the gift. Right. I don't lift. Yeah. So let me. So you're not fucking wrong, Cap, to the shitters. Yeah, you're not. You're fucking Lewis Hamilton. Earnhardt. <laughs> Whatever his name is. Ask Earn fucking right. sixty two ten dollars oh. cash YouTube. Now have you guys? I'm not going to mention. I Shit. just want yes or no answers, mm. okay? Mm. But have you got, remember two Fridays ago, we were supposed to have an employee Friday, a meeting uh, uh, last Friday, but Lummy was in the hospital. Sorry. Yes. But I did give you guys some homework. Yep. Are you guys working on that? Mm -hmm. Yes. Do you guys have some data to give me tomorrow? Yes. yes. 
perfect. How about how about you, Jesus? Have you been working on that? Are you going to just scramble around and make Ace do it tonight? Nope, no, nope, I've I've been doing it. Okay, thanks. Yep. Blitz, what's he Stacey's talking about? over doing, here. Doing what, Blitz? What's he talking about? Yeah. Hey, hey, Blitz, what the fuck's he talking about? My bag full of gears? It. I don't know. I, I know he told me to it. put some tire pressure in my left rear of my race car, but I can't fucking remember anything past that. Right. Wow. Exactly. I'm having something with my with my I, with my black eye. It's watering. Uh oh. Can you tell it's black still? Can you take your glasses it off? Yeah, it didn't look as bad, but I, I can. I've I've noticed you playing with it lately. Yeah. Looks like you got pink eye now. Uh-oh. Man, Dan did a couple. Dan did. I got to be honest with you. Dan did a little something to me. I mean, I got a little. You know, Monday I went to go see Dan. I got some shit done. Okay, you know, trying right. to look better. And I got some shit done, and I mean, I mean, he's got me. I mean, I look Cl- good as good as close, fuck. Close your right eye. Yeah, it's it's actually not as dark as it was yesterday. Like the corner of it's a little bit darker. Though. Yeah, the corner, the far corner is, is darker. Yeah. Looks like fucking Rob Khan popped me in the eye, didn't it? Mm-hmm. I got a little lippy with him, like Fabrizi did at my bachelor party. And I got popped. Yeah, you got learned mm-hmm. up. Have anybody? Has any of you guys ever got a black eye before? Oh yeah. No. I got yeah. a black eye once. I got hit in a. You know what, Blitz? I know I was going to bring this up. I think I'm going to get rid of my fucking goatee. I can't take it. Longer. Okay. It looks good, but it looks like it'd be annoying. Yeah, it look. Look at this shit. Yeah. It just. <clears throat> but I think I'm. I'll look so fucking weird without it that people are gonna clown me on that deal now. Now, do you think you'd be willing to dye it at all before you cut it? No, I don't. I don't dye think. It. I think I got enough enough natural darkness in it. Okay. I like. And it I think color. it's matching my hair pretty good. Yeah, I, I agree. Does. I agree. So, you know, you talked about, I mean, I think I look as about as good as fuck as I've looked in a while. Back, back like, I'd you, fuck myself right now. Back when you dyed your hair, you didn't like it because it wasn't dyed. So that was the issue then. But yeah, now but now it matches your hair. It's you fine. You're not reef anymore. And, and my hair ain't like over the top fucking Elvis, not believable shit. Right. Like my hair <laughs> yeah, like <it> is, but <laughs> is like, by the way, this is my natural hair. Yeah. Now I did get you some of that color shampoo. And you... I used it for the very first time. Okay. Last night. Okay. But it's on your beard too? No, I didn't use it on my beard. It, but it said blitz. It takes up to ten. Yeah, it takes a while. It's a, it's a gradual thing, and it doesn't it doesn't ever get rid of all of it. It just right. makes it darker. So, do you, Anna, do you think I should start washing my beard with it? I don't even fucking want my beard. Well, I like the way it is. I don't think you need to darken anything up. You got hair. I'm so, not darkening anything. Yeah, you got nice facial yeah, hair. It looks good. It's probably fucking. I've annoying, been training. But it looks really good. I've been training. To be honest with you, it makes your face look a lot slimmer. I like the glasses. I like the hair did. I've been fucking... Tr- like, hold on. If it's oh. not f- broken, don't fix it, Baba. Man, those are, those those are, are days. giant. Wait, I'm, I'm on delay, Willie. God damn it. You'll see him here in a minute. You'll see him here in a minute. Oh, hold on. Think Lummi can even see hold it? On, he just knows what's coming. He, let me just open the game. I'm like, how does he see me? He's not. Oh, you don't see the damn thing. He's just saying it because he knows what to say. Anna, did you see that? No, God. Fuck. God damn. No, I don't see it. Oh, there you go. You didn't see any of that shit? Now I see. Now I see. Fuck Pump that shit up. Pump it up. Pump, pump, pump it up. <laughs> Lummy, hold on. Lummy knows. As soon as Bubba starts saying, look at this, Lummy just goes, oh, that looks great, yeah, Even though Lummy's 17 seconds behind, no, he's like a minute behind. I could look like the fucking biggest lunch lady arm <laughs> motherfucker ever to live. Yeah, hold on. You I could, could literally. literally make a, you could make a face, stick out your tongue, go, how do I look? And let me go, you yeah. look so good. I literally <laughs> could like be, be flexing and it looked like the fattest piece of shit guy that's never been to the gym in the history of the world. And Lummy would be like, oh, fuck. Look at those dry eight. Jeez. Yeah, my God, gym. my Lord. No. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Jesus. Why is he coming? <laughs> yes. I mean, I will tell you this. Yes, sir. Um, I told you, motherfucker, I was not going to beg to be your hairstylist. I, I and asked. you've not. N- uh, no, 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 you haven't. Yeah, you said right before. You said a week before. Hey, well, uh, well, oh, that's right. New, he, that, yeah, we did. Plan newsflash. That. We planned it. Wilbur's coming next week. I, that's insane. I know. I, Wilbur's going to be here next week. <laughs> Fucking week. Yeah, I don't know if you know that or not, Lummy. You're gonna have a kid. I like, thought we planned it. This bud. time, Lummy. Lummy. Uh, uh, Tina. Oh, yeah. Tina May is in is in my super hot, fucking hot chicks that listen. Hot chicks that watch the after show do it on Facebook. Wizzy's here. Oh, it's like the face fucking chat room. Robin is here. Denise is here. All the hot. I mean, the, it's where the girls hang out. This is where the this is where the this this is where the fish is. I'm not trying to say you guys smell like fish. I was just being smart ass. 
Fish in the barrel. Blitz is getting in. Lummy, you're having a kid in nine days. Yeah. Nine or, fucking days, buddy. Yeah. Isn't it? They're taking it on Saturday the 25th, are they not? Well, uh, no, it's probably going to be like 20, the 24th. So, like, literally a week from today or yeah. like a week and a day from today. Yeah. yeah. Like, you're six to seven days away from having a kid. Motherfucker, we should. Ha- I should have been doing your fucking beard today. You dumbass. Well, I, oh. I think with going on, I think it got messed up because we planned on doing it this week. I think we were going to do it, uh, what, Tuesday or Wednesday? That was the original plan yeah. before everything kind of. I look like you a, said, before you said cock. You know, I look like, I look like a fat Glenn Beck. That's what a lot of people were oh saying this morning. No, I, 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 didn't, I didn't want to repeat no, it. No, 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 no. It's not fat. It's rugged. Because Glenn yeah, Beck's I guarantee I could fucking he, beat Glenn Beck's ass. Oh, and course. Glenn Be- Beck is not thin by any stretch of the imagination. No, but he's... So you just look like Glenn he, Beck. Well, hold on. He's 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 thinner than me, <laughs> well, but I guarantee I mean, he, he can't fucking lift like I can. No, no, no way. No yeah, you're can. fucking rugged, Glenn yeah. Beck. Hell yeah. Fucking really? Well, look at that. Oh, God back damn. over here. Goddamn Stockholm motherfucker. There's no way that fucking Save some for the rest of us. Big nose. Papa. Mm. Remember, they're on a delay, Bubba. <laughs> <laughs> what? They haven't seen shit yet. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> <sighs> so, let me. you're going to have a kid, buddy. Yeah. yeah. You're going to be a I would be. Papa. I would be fucking... Beside myself. Yeah, let me. How you feeling, buddy? Like, what's the deal? Like, let me talk. You're, I mean, are you excited? You, let me you talk. Worried? I am. Let me talk. I, I feel good. I feel. I feel. I mean, besides the fact that I, I, I don't feel like myself, but uh, other than that, I feel good. Why do you feel like yourself? Because I was died. Oh, I don't know. Thanks. I still oh, feel. Oh, don't out of play it. that fucking no, deal. I, I don't feel. I mean, it's we the, know. I almost died martyr game. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you know, Lummy. my sister's already fucking hates me. Yeah. No, it's not that. I just, I just don't feel like a hundred percent all the oh, time. Oh, there's my Eileen. But I, Eileen I Collins love. Oh, that's the racer. Well, I went on a few dates with back in the day. Yeah, well, that's the, all I'm saying. The daughter for Blitz. Yeah. But, let me. My sister's already got. I wasn't saying that. I was yeah, just saying un- I don't feel like unmeasurable yeah, heat. Unmeasurable heat. With you me. can't even measure it. It's so right. fucking bad. Unmeasurable. That I'm just going to be honest with you. You know what? I am. Looking for an apartment, and I just got to figure out. She's not kicking you out. You're just looking because it's, yeah, t- she, it's just. Do you time. need a, just, Do you need a storage apartment? No. And I just got to ask Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, I'm looking for apartments. Do you want me to get? Listen, I want you to move out so I can stay there, Daddy. I want you to be honest, okay, buddy. I just want you to be honest. Do you want me to get a two bedroom and you live with me? Or would you rather stay where you are now? I will not be mad either. It doesn't doesn't matter. It's a trap, Jesus. Yeah. No, Jesus, it ain't a trap. Be honest, Jesus. I mean, what do you want me to do? No. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, that's a good answer. I want you to stay with me. Well, there you go. I want you to stay with me. I, I really do. I really like you living with me. You we're answer it the right way, buddy. Yeah. We're buddies. You know, you, you, I mean, I just, I, I'd rather you just be with me. And I was thinking about moving closer here, like to one of these, one of these apartments. Kind of, you know, kind of like over there. Uh, I know exactly where I've looked at all these apartments. By right the Russia area? Yeah, 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 like like those new ones, like yes. right by uh, where the Outback and all that shit is oh, over there. Yeah, those are nice. They're I'm really thinking nice. about over there, uh, Tyler. Okay. But I can see where... I could drive my new scooter <clears throat> to work. Tara is going to offer you to stay there. I know she is. And But I want you to come I want you to come live with me, but I don't want to cause a problem with the family. And well, it's well, Daddy, what I'd like to do is I'm going to come stay. I'm going to stay with Tara, but if you could get a two-bedroom and I'll come hang out with you all the time, that'd be great. Well, what's your answer, Todd? Are you, I mean, you know, what would you want to do? Uh, I'll do whatever you want me to do. All right, well, then you're staying with me. We're moving the fuck out of there, okay? Woo. All right. All right, see you later. Don't sound too excited. Just another moving deal. Yep. Get a truck. Oh, let me remember that one time it was me, you, and Colton. <laughs> yeah, I actually got oh, I actually got God. pictures. You know how your phone will say like you know two years ago today like some shit you know mm-hmm. like give you like the memories kind of deal. Let me. It was me, Buck, you. on Facebook. Big, Ten thousand stars. Oh Big my Charleston. God, Big Buck from Charleston. And, Big Buck and 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 Lump and Blitz. He's I, I don't know that he can qualify for a ring this year, but he certainly. Yeah, I don't know. Setting look. himself up for a good one for next year. I'll have to look. Yeah. 
10,000. And it says he's been donating for 10. So he's if he's been, been doing, he's been doing that for a while. So yeah. if he's donating 10,000 for 10 weeks, that puts him at, that puts him a, th- that puts him a thousand bucks Halfway away there. from being, yeah. I mean, Buck, if you d- turn the wick up in the next two weeks, you get your motherfucking ring. Woo. So anyway. Yeah, Big Red, you better get your tr- look. At Big Red knows where the bitches are, doesn't he? Yeah. You don't see him over on on y- Yes Tiz. Nope, he jumps ship. It just sucks moving, and I just don't want my sister to be mad at me. But it's just time, and it's more importantly that, for her. She, poor thing. Yeah, I have a question. Can I'm, I rent can, a room? I, for- I, I, I got a question it's about money because I'm Jewish. Can I put that in there? Yeah. Can I ask a question about money because I'm Jewish? Go is ahead. It, is there a thing where I can rent a room out in my apartment for someone to for as storage? Yeah, storage of bodies, maybe. You mean, are you trying to say that you want to rent out Reagan's or yours? Whatever? Are you going to move to her room? No, she's probably going to leave next year. And I was thinking, is there a way that I could rent the space but not have someone live there? So you want someone to rent a storage unit from you? Yeah. Okay, you know, storage, storage units are from- about, you know, like, you know, $69 a month. Yeah. So, like, why the fuck? Right. Would they pay would you, you three fifty? The pool. And why no. would you want someone in your house at like three a.m. because yeah. they need to get a trinket out of their room? Right. Yeah. They need to get fucking Christmas ornaments. <laughs> right. Just, I don't know. It'd be no. Nice to like Anna, live no. alone and then just. Anna, have, why don't? Why and then instead of having a big roll-up door, they got to go through regular doors and hallways. Yeah, and that's shit. Anna, worse. Anna, I got a great idea. Yeah. No, for real, I got a great idea. Yeah. But you got to fucking listen. I'm far I'm more, I'm far more worldly than you. Plus, I know. I, plus, I'm looking good as fuck. You're looking fucking mm-hmm. good as so. So good. Hair on point. So, fuck Reagan probably would have blasted me before she met this fella if I right. would have fucking had my game like this. Oh, 100%. Yeah. So anyway, because I'm I'm Jim I'm what, what I'm, I'm Jim Gear I'm Jim Gear uh, Jim Jim Clooney Jim, Jim Clooney, Jim Clooney. Jim Clooney. Yeah. little brother of John, whatever Clooney Jim Clooney. So Anna, why don't you go to your apartment complex okay. and say I've been with you for you know like five years five years. And my roommate, you tell me, and by the way, you do have lawyers at your expense, too. Don't fucking forget that. And, you know, I would like to downsize to a one-bedroom apartment. Okay. And I don't need a two-bedroom, but I want to stay within the community. I want to keep, I want to keep, you know, living here. I've lived here for so many years. And I do really like it there. And I really like it here, but I'd like to downsize to a one-bedroom. And Anna, between all of us guys and the Get Fresh crew, I mean, we would literally... I mean, you have your shit all boxed up. You know, we're not going to go fucking box your shit up, but you get your shit all boxed up, and all the dudes, Blitz, you know all the dudes would come together, and, and we could have her moved in two hours. Yeah. No, no, no. It would be like 10 minutes. Okay. I don't have that much stuff. All right, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So we, like, you know, all, the boys would, because Here, qu- that's what friends do, man. Friends would be like, I got you, man. I got a fucking truck. Here, I got a trailer. Yeah. Here, here's the question, though. How much cheaper is a one-bedroom versus the two? <sighs> It's Probably three or four hundred bucks. No, it's not that much. It's usually like a hundred and some bucks. It's like a hundred it? bucks. Yeah, it's it's not much. Is that all it is, Anna? Yeah. I mean, Anna, it's... do your stats because I can't. I'll do it right now. <clears throat> okay. What do you think a two bedroom is? Fourteen hundred. Yeah, it's it's a little over fourteen hundred for right, us for a two bedroom. Correct. I guarantee you, one bedroom is eight hundred. No, no. It's like it's like, 11, it's like 11 or twelve. Yeah. I'll yeah. look it up, but I'll show you, Bubba. It's it's not it's 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 better for me to just stay in the two yeah, and get and have more stand. space. Yep. But, but what's okay? Because you got to think too, Bobby. She has a two bedroom, one bath, not a two bedroom, two bath. All right. So what are you gonna do in the other bedroom? I don't know. That's what I was thinking about renting it out for that's, space. Uh, that, that's not gonna work. Storage. Hmm. No, that's a you horrible would be, idea. Do you know what? Know. Be, you know what you would actually be is to build you a little podcast studio. For real, uh, you don't ever fucking look ahead or try to invest in any bullshit. You know, you just I have fucking podcasting you equipment. do you do enough just to get by. You're fucking career lazy. We, I mean, Blitz, first of all, if you just fucking showed a little bit of fucking respect to Blitz, motherfucker would build you a state-of-the-art facility. I'm just telling you that right that's, now. Well, that's where I'm staying at, the second room. I'm building a streaming studio deal in there. Right. Yep. And 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 I'm, I'm just saying, Anna, and you could like... I don't <clears throat> like working out of my home, though. So you're just going to have an empty bedroom? Well, I... First of no, all, I'm nobody... No, i to get another roommate. Okay. Fuck that. That's what I'm saying. I I would rather just live alone, but it's expen- It's a little out of my price range. So no, but I want you to give me a price. I'm looking for it right now. I think it's probably Blitz is wrong on this one huh. with his big boy fucking haircut. He I says he you're saying fourteen hundred for a two bedroom. 
But a one bedroom is twelve hundred. Yeah, it's like eleven, twelve hundred. Let me. Are you looking at the fucking website, or are you I just saying it off your top of your stupid head? I was looking it up when I was looking at trying to rent a place. Apartments. Yeah, I've. Been, I mean, I've can't I, you can't you go to your actual complex uh, website? I'm doing that right now. Okay, if they have any available. All right. It seems like it's way more expensive now. It's saying that one bed, one bath is like eighteen hundred. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's because they're jacking all That's the what I'm saying. prices. So here's the thing, Bubba, is she's better to stay where she's at now at the rate that she's at, or they'll jack it up a little bit versus going to a one bedroom. She'll probably end up spending more money to yeah. move to a one bedroom. How much longer is your lease? Till May. All right. So it probably makes sense. To just stay. Even if until, I stayed there, I'd be May. paying $300 less Hold for on. an extra room. That's Understand. what I'm saying. But when, May, but when May comes up and your lease is up, you better hang the fuck on. They're gonna jack your shit. They well, always do, but I always talk them down. So yeah. usually they'll they'll jack it up maybe like eighty, a hundred, and I always get them down to just jack it up to fi- you know fifty, forty, yeah. fifty. So they have the they have the increase. If that makes sense. After yeah. I talk to them, but I always have to talk to them because they have a standard increase every year. Yeah, yeah. but do you use? I've been here five fucking years. Oh, every time I talk to them, and they always lower it down, yep. and I always thank them for it, and it's like a thing. So. We we could find you a roommate. Oh. <laughs> yeah. the fuck I want. We'll reach out to the Bub Army. <laughs> I, fu- I fucked myself. Yep. I, I just played myself like DJ Khaled. <laughs> DJ Khaled! Another Ooh. one. What you should do. Major key. Is what you should do. Is you should just keep sewing that Tara is the coolest bitch ever seed. And yeah. she just let you fucking because st- she. No, I'm not going to live with Tara. She needs her own fucking space. Not really. She's, after dealing with your ass, like, you know. I think she's getting ready to. Buy a bigger house. I don't know, but I think she's going to sell that one. I'm just, you know, trying to pencil myself in on Janie Cakes' place when she's not, you know, not around anymore. With all those hot cougs. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But man, my mom, my, my mom's community that she lives in. Yeah, there's, a lot of there's, swingers, there's, a lot of no, 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 hold on. There's no hot cougs. No. There's, I mean, like. Why? I would be like the hottest dude in the entire place. Fuck yeah, you would. No, but I'm saying like they're all eighty. That's hot. Like, no, eighty is the new. No, eighty is not the new sixty. What's the What's <laughs> the oldest chick you'd bang today? Probably somebody my age. Okay. I mean, like, well, I don't know if I should really get it tuned into this too you probably much. Probably should. Yeah. I mean, it was years ago. Oh, that older, the, the landlord? No, 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 there's another one. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. Your how mom's old, friend? How old was she? No, but I, I'll i just tell you this. I graduated with her at Warsaw High School. Okay. She, I, gradu, I graduated with her. She was my classmate. Yeah. At, at Warsaw. And later in life... Uh, like circa, well, I don't even want to give the years. Okay. But it was, you know, well after we graduated. I'll say this. It was, um, it was from two, it was from 2000 to 2005. Okay. And I hooked up with her and she's my age, obviously. So she's, she was like 40. She was. But yeah, yeah, at the time, okay. but she, but she was at that time, you know, I'd never been with somebody my age. Mm-hmm. And so she's exact. She might even be a year older than me. Whoa. Well, hold on. What about that fucking Ellie bitch? Yeah. <clears throat> no, no, no. She's dead now. Well, Ellie was in Chicago. Yeah, but how old was she? She's like 65. No, no. But like, I really liked this girl. Like I could have had like a relationship with this girl. Whoa. <clears throat> and, but I fucked it up. You did. Yeah, I really fucked That's it up. That's out of character. And the only person that knows about it is Larry Plummer. He's the only guy that knows about about this. Because she was married at the time. And was going through a divorce. Oh, so she wasn't with the guy, though. No, no, no. She was going through a divorce. They okay. were actually not even... They were actually separated. She lived... Well, I can't tell you where she lived. Not with him. Not with him. Okay. And... um. I really, really messed up on that one because she was super fucking cool and she was from my hometown and she knew everything about me and she knew how I was. Like she, she knew, still liked you. I mean, she knew, I mean, she truly knew me. 
Wow. Like, do you even know you? No, no, but I, hmm. I don't know that anybody really I knows me. Deep. Like, nobody really knows me. Yeah. I don't even know that Tyler really knows. Uh, Jesus, I don't think you even really know me, me, do he, you? He does not. I mean, yeah. A little bit. No, yeah. he does not. Yeah. Okay. What do you mean I don't? Let's not ruin him, I mean, Blitz. you don't know me. No, no, he doesn't. I mean, you didn't know me. He didn't know you were married I mean, until like a couple yeah. weeks ago. Hold on. You've only known me since 2002, because that's when you were born. When you were born. Born did. So, you know, like, you know, I had a whole big life before that. Rolling around with a lot of cricks. <laughs> he does know you, Bubba. He does actually know you. <laughs> I'll listen to how the weird does that sound? How weird does that feel coming out of your son? Cricks. Uh, rolling so, around with a lot of cricks. So, I really messed up because, and not to be disrespectful to anybody that I've married or had a relationship with or that was engaged to or anybody in my life, you know, that I've been romantically involved with. But, um, but this girl was, you know, probably the one that really knew me. Wow. Well, I mean, you got to think, Blitz. I went to school with this girl yep. for 12 years. Mm-hmm. I went to school with this girl for 12 years. And that, that means a lot. Would you say she's the one that got away? That's what I was just going to say. Mm. Um, yeah, yeah. Y- Commit y- to it. Yes and no. Okay, Ooh. well. Because. Wow. What do you mean? Because there could be a, a few of those. There could be a few of those. Mm. And that's all I'm going to say. I'm getting myself in just way too much trouble because some people listen to this show and take it way too literally. <laughs> and I have to under- remind people I'm in the fucking show business. Show business. I'm in here to tell stories. I, wanna, I mean, I, I know, I'm not saying to say and I know you won't, but like, I want to hear names. <sighs> I know a couple. And Larry Plummer was like, are you fucking kidding me, buddy? Was this, was this chick hot? Not getting into any other fucking parameters on this Obviously one. Obviously she was hot. But you'll start putting it all together. It's Bubba. Yeah, Bubba doesn't fuck really well candy, I guess, but he farted on her. Oh, you got in a blowjob. <laughs> Sometimes fart, you never fart on a bitch. I farted on a girl when I was in college, a bigger did, girl that well, was giving me head. Did you best and Tyler let, know this story? Oh, I forgot. With I Jeff keep Bird? fucking working. Tyler, I keep, Tyler, get your ass on the to- on the on the no, slate mic. No, no, don't. Please. We didn't know if you know this story well, or not. Bubba, did no, you, <laughs> you don't know this one. No, have, no. You, have you ever heard it? No. Well, then we gotta tell it. Well, I can't talk to my kid about. Lummy, Lummy knows it. Go ahead, yeah. Lummy. What happened? Well, Lummy, yes. I'm telling you not to say a fucking word. <laughs> uh, big buck, a thousand stars. Uh, Bubba, can I? Okay, I'm not going to say anything about candy that you farted on with your bird, but um, <laughs> while she was blowing him. Okay, but don't, Bubba, don't say nothing about that. Did you bang the chick at the Ario Speedwagon that hurt your back? <laughs> the one that you put on your shoulders and, no. and like blew your back and that out. Was Brian, she, it was Brian Adams. Brian Adams, sorry. I went to a Brian Adams concert in 1982 in Fort Wayne, and and so back then when you would go to a concert, you'd be down on the floor. Well, you know, your girl that you had would get on your shoulders. And okay? No. Oh, no. Yeah. So no, hold on. So Larry Plummer's there, and he's got Tanya, his girlfriend, and she's just, te- she's a track girl yeah, she's who like works on high. Pounds. And she's like 105 Perfect. pounds. Yeah. Fucking, so she fits a template. Like, honest, she's like you. Like, she's like thin in shape runner hot as fuck hot yeah, hot she, unlike she's hot <laughs> as absolute fuck right just like me right and then i got one of my other friends i forget who and he's got his, her girl his girlfriend and she's like <laughs> you know like 115 and Man, i had to take this, i took this girl and she was about she kind of looked like hugo the whale <laughs> well no but she was about size bubba no but she was about 160 <laughs> and <laughs> You know, in, in high school, I was like 220. My senior year when I played football, I was like 220. <laughs> and, you know, Larry's like 210. Yeah. And my buddy Bart, who went with us, I think he's like, you know, he's 210, 215. Yeah, so like 105 ain't nothing. So we're like, yeah, like we're For just them. regular dudes. Yeah. And so, you know, Larry uh, ho- hoists up Tanya, puts puts him, her on his shoulder. She's up there fucking watching. And Bart gets his girl up on his shoulder. And then your girl And looks my girl at you. goes and says... And I go, um, <laughs> and then I said, hey, Larry, can you put Tanya down to help her get on my back? Oh, no. So I got my big boy jeans on, and I'm literally, watch this, I'm literally squatted down 
like this at the concert. Damn it, I have to wait a minute. Wait, wait. I'm like squatted down like mm -hmm. this. And then I got to like try to, and I can't get her to fuck try, up. Drive at the heels. Drive at the heels. Yeah, I'm like, you know, you know, at that point I was probably squatting 400 or so, but that's weightlifting. That's not a human being. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's moving, moving and shaking. And yeah, around. big fucking top Oblong, heavy yeah. bitch. It's the Kool Aid man on the And your so back. I, get, I get her, I get her. I get, look at I'm squatted down. I, get, oh, I Larry, squat Larry now. helps her up. Yeah. She's on my shoulders. <laughs> and so, you know, everybody's, everybody's <laughs> fucking enjoying the concert and my back. Is on fire. I feel like you I've, a disc. I feel like I went from five ten to five six. <laughs> I feel like I'm just like I have, like I'm so. I go Larry. I said Larry, and he's he's right beside me, shoulder to shoulder. I go, man, my fucking back's on fire. <laughs> he goes, tell her you got to go to the bathroom. You got to piss. I go, oh okay. So I I I, I reach. I said, hey, I gotta go piss. <laughs> She's like, okay, well let me down. I took. I was gone for a half an hour. Just because I was trying to stretch out my back. <laughs> you're in the, no, you it wasn't. You walk out of the bathroom going, someone give me a squeeze close, please. <laughs> Somebody get, they may got an inversion table. I don't know if they had inversion tables I'm in 82, but I would have paid $10 pounder. for one. Lakeland Hoosier, $25. <laughs> Cash YouTube. Guys, guys, guys. So I just, you, I've been carrying this 160 pound around all night. I need to squeeze squeeze. Oh, somebody, please. Did you bang? Did you bang her? <laughs> no, no, I did not. But so anyway, she, I she and, fucked you back up and didn't even get so like in, out of it. Like in '99, yeah. Like this, I think. So I the the girl that I'm talking about mm -hmm. that I it, it's like ninety. Oh, it's ninety at rock days. It's like ninety nine two thousand. Okay, and I'm syndicated. Making super good money. Yeah, ninety nine, two thousand. You're balling. Yeah, I'm fucking balling. You're the man. Just built my new house. Mm -hmm. I'm single at this time. Yeah, nine eleven 7, hasn't 000, happened. Seven thousand gallon aquarium. Yeah, I mean, I'm just straight fucking balling. And I go back to Indiana, and we meet up for like dinner. And do you fuck her face? Oh, no. That's a oh. fair question. My kid listens. Yeah, he knows. You've you've asked his grandmother if she likes getting fisted. It was Rocky, I believe. Yeah, Rocky, Rocky. Do you like get Rocky? By the way, my mom still has not talked to me. Have you reached out to her? I've tried. Well, you, uh, Tyler, do you know anything that I don't? Am I supposed to, like? Are they still all fucking hot at me? I don't know. <laughs> it, can you get anything out of this little fucker? <laughs> no. Nope. It's a locked box. Have you? Let me have to deal with that shit every Wednesday night. Have you con <laughs> Have you contacted her? No, not since last weekend. Okay. When you do, will you tell her, "Hey, don't be mad at dad." Uh, yeah. Okay, thanks. So Switzerland over here. Blitz, or, Blitz. I meet. We meet. We meet for dinner, right? And like we're talking, and it's just like, oh my god, we're talking about all of our high school times and cool. all of our yeah, friends yeah. Mm -hmm. and hey what's tammy lambert doing nowadays and oh my god i heard she uh, married phil sands and they got a couple kids mm -hmm. and hey did you hear carl ottersberg's living in new york and he's a big time artist and you know my buddy larry you know larry's fucking head of the park and yeah recap and, yeah like you know how, and and how's your mom doing her mom was sick at the time and and you just she had a brother and it was just like right they took a top off so then so then mm. And it was a pretty, it was a pretty, uh, you know, expensive place. Like a steakhouse? No, it was like a sushi place. Oh, okay. And so after, I can remember like nothing. I had my own hotel room. Whoa. And um, I said, I'm walking her to her car because she had to park like in a parking garage or something. Mm -hmm. And I'm walking to her car and I'm like, hey. You know, you want to bust? <laughs> they want bust. <laughs> you want to bust? No, I, I didn't know what to say because this, this, she was like, I never pictured myself in a million years being in this partic in this partic really? yeah, never. And so, how, how did it, how did it become that you guys met up to meet out in the first place? Like, how did that go out? Like, how did that work? I don't know if it was on MySpace or if it was on. I don't know. Okay. But you obviously uh, kept in contact to some degree. Yeah, but, but you were like, "Hey, I'm coming up there. You know, why don't we go have yeah. dinner?" Yeah, yeah, I was, I was, yeah, okay. And I'm not even going to say the city. I think people will probably put. I think people can probably put the city together. Right. But she's like, "Yeah." So 
I meet her and she's telling me she's going through this divorce and that they're separated and that it's going to be final and, you know, such and such. And so then afterwards, I walk her to her car and I, I said, hey, do you want to go back to my hotel? You know, because there's a bar there. Sure. Oh, nice. And she's like, yeah, I'd like that. I'm like, oh, man, I'm, I'm like, I'm in. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm in. And then, I, then I'm like, I, I got to pinch my, are you fucking kidding me? You're going to, you know, mm-hmm. this is like. So we go back to my bar, to the bar, and she has a couple drinks. She's starting to feel pretty good. And she, she we don't fuck. Huh? What? No, I end up, she's like, I, I, th- I think I better not have any more drinks. I won't be able to drive home because I think I'm running up my limit. So I'm like, well, let's just. Make it get, a double. Well, <laughs> You said to the bartender, make it a double. Make, make it a double with a fucking <laughs> with a couple Bill shots. Cosby. With a couple shots. I'm taking some Viagra. <laughs> so, but I was a perfect gentleman. So I, she like stopped drinking and like we talked for like 45 minutes to an hour. And the whole entire time, the only thing I'm doing is trying to get her up to the you know, to, uh, to my room. Of course. My suite. And she's like. You know, Bubba, I really, really like you, and I would really like, you know, to fuck or, you know, whatever she said, mm-hmm. but I really, and this is like not really, it, it sounds like a real big cop-out, but it really isn't a cop-out. Okay. If a girl, I mean, she's like, I really like you, and I'd really like for this to turn into something, but obviously you live in Florida, and I live here, and she had, she had kids, mm-hmm. so... And I and I didn't know I didn't even have a kid at that time. Little I know I was going to have one. Mm-hmm. But <clears throat> she's like, I got kids, and you live in Florida. I don't know if this is we're gonna, you know could work out or not, you know. But maybe we could try it. But if I go back and fuck you, then it's it's just not going to make what we potentially could have as good or cool. Hmm. And I'm like, I'm kind of feeling it. I'm like, you know. I don't want to crick her out. I mean, I've, I've known this girl for, you know, all of my life. Well, you know, okay. since I was in kindergarten. Look at you. And so we don't do anything. Don't oh, well, even I take kiss? that back. We, yeah, we make out like okay. a motherfucker. Okay. That's fine. So mm-hmm. I take her back to her. I walk her like maybe a block to her car. And this is a kinder, gentler Bubba. This isn't the calloused Bubba of today. Mm-hmm. I, you know. Which and, is weird because it was 99 and you were a dick back then. Well, in some instances. Right. Was this like when you were 488 or like what were you No, on? no, no, no. Mm-mm. And so probably 275, 280. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> oh, yeah. Super dialed in. Yeah, probably like, no, no, it's super dialed in is 249. That's oh, sorry, the best sorry. it's ever been, 249. You were dialed in, you just weren't super dialed yeah, in. Yeah, super dialed. Okay, good. <clears throat> and so um, we start kind of. And I and I plan like two trips to Indiana that summer, oh. and ju- just to see her. And on the se- now and at that time, Blitz, we do start fucking. Okay. Oh, see like, you fucker. The se- well, yeah. The se- uh, by the second time, right? It's been a month now. You're not going to keep going up to Indiana. To yeah, not get right. Ass. Yeah, well, that's but, dumb. So the second time I go up there, we had already talked a lot, and you know had. Kind of talked about what 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 we might be doing. What 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 let me what 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 we got. And so, and at that point, I think that she was either her divorce was final or it was like weeks away. Okay, just paperwork. Like relationships done. Right. And her husband was a complete dick. He'd already moved on. Was like fucking his secretary. He was a super big slinging dick, like lawyer or some bullshit. Yeah. So she and she had money because she, her. I mean, she was gonna get. She was gonna get like half the equity in the house. Like she was gonna be fine. So she was truly, and not that anybody that I'm with in today's environment, or anybody that I see in today's environment, or not all women that I've been with have been money driven. A lot have. Money changes things. It does. I could write a book about it. Yeah, money changes everything, especially when you don't have it. <laughs> And so, and so, but this particular girl, Blitz, she had known me since I was, sure. you know, six years old. I get it. And so, 
And I and I and I don't know that I even had as much money as her husband did, you know, back then. But whatever mm-hmm. the fuck, I had money. And so that summer, I think it was the summer of ninety nine or two thousand, I go up to Indiana like four times. And we're like kinda seeing each other. Kinda. And she actually puts nobody knows this. I've never told this story. She meets me one time in North Carolina. Oh. She flew to, we met in Asheville, North Carolina, and spent the weekend in Asheville, North Carolina. Up in the mountains? In the mountains. Remember, remember when I was telling Kevin Hazlett about Asheville? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, that's, Those that's, are the that memories. was my reference. Yeah. So, <clears throat> so then, I don't know, if, like, I don't know what the fuck happened. I don't know if I found some crick down here. You know, I don't know. But I just kind of blew her off. Did you go to uh, livestock around then? Yeah, you know, uh, <laughs> I think I probably met Heather. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I think I met Heather. What year did you meet Heather? And I, and I called her around then. Let me see. And Heather was, I think Heather was. Like 2004. Or no, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm, I'm just going to tell you years wise. <laughs> Hold on. You know, Heather was nine years younger than her. But probably didn't really like me like the way this chick did. And I just blew her the fuck off. I can't remember. She'd call me and I wouldn't take her phone call. Uh-huh. And she would be like, what's going on? What's changed? Like, the, you know, the last time we what were What did together. I do wrong? <clears throat> yeah, like, 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 what's changed? And like, you know, I just saw you two weeks ago and it was like. Great. And what the, now, and mm-hmm. it's just like, man, I just got me some new pussy and, you know. I didn't say that. Yeah. Out loud. Did you ever even give her an answer? Yeah, I did. What'd you tell her, though? <clears throat> that just the long distance shit wouldn't work. And, okay, there you go. You know, but I really, really like you, and I just wish our timing was different. Mm hmm. Mm. So there's that one. Did she, like, offer to move or anything? I don't know if we need to get into all that, but probably. <laughs> so the problem is so, so she I, offers the movie, and you're like, no. Well, we were in Asheville that one time, and she's like, I really like it down here. And, and she's been to, I mean, she'd been to Florida a lot with mm-hmm. her husband. Her husband was like, again, an attorney. Okay. And they traveled quite extensively. In fact, I think, I think he may have had like a, a condo in West Palm or something like all that, right. I think. And so they vacationed down there. So she was very... Now, she wasn't familiar with the white trash version of West Palm, which is Tampa, mm-hmm. but still. And I, I just did her so... I just did her fucking just completely fucking dirt. I just did her like a real dick. Yeah. That's not cool. Yeah. Sorry. So <laughs> have you talked to her since then at all? No. She got remarried. Oh, good. And... um, so how she look now? She looks good. I mean, I don't know. I don't. I don't really go to her shit. Oh, does it make you sad? No. Oh. I, her kid. Her, uh, her kids have graduated from college. I think they're both doing good. But I can tell you this, Blitz. I I have looked at her Facebook, and she looks sad because she's got like a <laughs> she old. She married like a guy like ten years older than us. Oh, and she just looks sad. She knows what she knows. What she could have. She should know. She could have had Bubba Clem from mm-hmm. 1915 Rosemont, buddy. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. <laughs> she could have been on the reef for a while, but she nope. could have been on the reef. Look how oh, that fucking reef action fish. too. Mm-hmm. I got to go into Dan's like I think in two weeks with Carrie. She's gonna start doing some more shit to me. Can you oh, tell nice. us what she's doing? No, I'm not telling you shit. Okay. It's gonna look good as fuck. You think fucking Hollywood stars tell you? Hey, let me tell you what I got done. No, Maybe they just you know. tell you I. I look good as fuck. Hmm. Hmm. They used to always lie about it and say, I got nothing done. Now Remember Joan like, Rivers would be like, I've never had a... F- bitch, you look like a fucking Siamese cat. Yeah. <laughs> you haven't had nothing Your done. Your face isn't even moving when you talk. Did you know I met her one time? <clears throat> Joan Rivers? Uh-huh. Where? She, at at uh, the Sirius building. Oh, she's awesome. And, she, I, and I will tell you this. She was cool as fuck. She was absolutely and funny. She would just roll around, cut on people, like she was literally She's cutting fucking. She promos. was cutting promos on Ronnie because she wanted to go into the studio earlier mm-hmm. than she was supposed to. And Ronnie, like, you ain't getting by Ronnie. 
And she was like, listen, you little sawed off motherfucker. You, I mean, and like she was just cut. And her, I think her daughter was at Melissa. Melissa, yeah. She yeah. was with her mom. But I'll tell, you, I'll tell you right now, the coolest bitch I ever met, ever. I know who you're going to say. Sharon Osbourne. Oh, I didn't think you were going to say that. Tim Collinger, a thousand stars. I going to say Tina Turner. I thought well, you say Sarah Silverman. Well, you know what, Blitz? You're, 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 you're pretty close on that one. Sarah Silverman yep. was pretty cool, but... Yeah, yeah, I would say Sarah Silverman was a notch cooler, but fucking Sharon Osbourne was the nicest, co- coolest person I've ever met, celebrity-wise. Like, What's she was here? so nice. So cool. And Tina Turner was cool, too. That was back in 86. So you got quite a spread, I remember. No, we were backstage in one of our, one, one of our the midday girl, uh, Renee, Renee Bass, yeah. was sick. We had taken a bunch of listeners over to the Tina Turner concert uh-huh. uh, from Terre Haute, and one of our our the the midday girl Renee Bass was kind of like had like a flu or some bullshit and was sick, and so we were in this little holding room and they had like a little catering deal, and Tina Turner walks in and she's taking pictures with everybody and she and Renee is kind of sitting down with her hands in her face, not feeling good, like obviously not feeling good. And Tina, Tina, Tina Turner be like, sister girl, are you not feeling well? And she's like, no, this is just some midday bitch from Tarot in Indiana. And that fucking Tina Turner. Mm-hmm. And Tina Turner says, you know what? I have a, I guess these big time acts, they have a doctor on staff that, that tours with them. Yeah, a traveling doctor. And she says, let me go get my doctor. And the doctor went and like, did her blood pressure and, you know, made sure she was, and actually wrote her a prescription that Renee, wait, well, she didn't get filled to the next day when we got home. 122 but, milligrams Xanax, here you go. Yeah, no shit. You'll feel better. <clears throat> but I mean, like, I thought that, I mean, like, that was so cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's awesome. <clears throat> I just saw a documentary on her, on Tina Turner. Isn't she, does she live in Switzerland or something? I don't know, but. She's like a Swiss She ended up marrying, like, uh, I don't know if it was a fan or, like, her manager. You know, Ike beat the fucking shit out of her. Ike Turner For was... how long? Ike Turner Erwin was... Erwin Bach is her husband now. Ike Turner was the biggest mother asshole ever to live. He was so mean to her. I have a question. And he beat the fuck out of her. Is what? he the one that, like, made her, though? Is that what it is? Well, I mean, you like, know, I mean... Kind of like Joe were, Jackson. I mean, they, they, they were a duo. No, they, they were a they duo. They were a duo? Oh, I Erwin know Bach is a music executive. Uh, blah, blah, blah. He worked on... Ike and Tina Turner. And he's in Switzerland, so yeah. No, um, is he, is Ike still alive? No, he died. Yeah, he died. Mm-hmm. Ha! This is my fucking Ike Turner, and I beat the shit out of my chick. No, I mean he may have given her. You know, Ike Turner was a star, and then he brought her on. Yeah, and she was just kind of a backup Willie. But then, well after Ike, she had a far more. You know, she he Prolific may he, he may, yeah. I mean, he may have. You know, that'd be like you know, I gave Lummy his chance, but then Lummy went on to be the next fucking Howard Stern. I got you. Well, that really fucking chat my ass. <laughs> like a, Lummy, if you went on to you be know, the I next was Howard Stern, my series kept calling him. <laughs> <laughs> Blitz, he died in San Marcos. Blitz, I haven't even told you this. Do you know I got a job offer yesterday to voice track afternoons on a. Rock on a classic rock station. What? Yes. Oh, nice. Where at? Um, I can't tell you. Okay. But big market or no? Big market. Okay. And pretty fucking big money. I was gonna say, what does it pay? A hundred. Okay. Hmm. For fucking real. Huh. And and it's between me and and two. There's three finalists, and this one dude is like, why don't we take? You know, uh, and they want to take like parts of my show and cut it up. Hmm. I don't know. It's still in the. Uh, it, yesterday was the very first day that I talked to the guy, so I shouldn't probably even be talking about this. Right. But I haven't given out enough information. But it's a major market, and they want me to, after my show, hook up with another guy that they have in mind. Okay. And we do like two hours and that they that, that, that they record and then they cut up and make into an afternoon drive show. Instead of playing like 
eight or nine records an hour. They're going to play like five. Okay. And me and this guy, who I'm very familiar with and can work with, are the afternoon drive guys. Huh. And it and it pays a hundred. Wow. Fuck! I couldn't sign up for that. Right. I couldn't sign up for that and give the guy oral fast enough. I was just kidding about that one. I was going to say, because Tyler just went, oh, my God. Oh, come on, man. I'm not giving a guy oral. It's just an expression. Not for 100 grand. I mean, Blitz, haven't you ever heard expression? Yeah, not only, but I'll blow you for of that. Of course. I mean, hey, uh, what would you do for $10 million? Well, I'll tell you what I'd do. I'd fucking take the $10 million and then I'd fucking blow you. Yeah. I mean, whatever. It's just an expression. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But for $10 million, I mean... For ten million, I'd blow a guy. <laughs> That's what I said. I would do it. Yeah, it'd be dumb if you didn't. Yeah, I'd be like, it's just, it's moral. It's just, I would say you're not going to do something there. I'm, I'm, I'm not right, doing right, it all right. the way. Yeah, like you better give me a cur. You better let me know when. Well, what, when if stuff's said, what if he said all the way? <sighs> so, like, is it, is it you'd say, you'd say, let me see that ten million cash first. I'd say, give me fifty percent down, yeah. and give me some <laughs> mouthwash. <laughs> apple cider vinegar or something. I need, I need ten million in in, in mouthwash. Yeah, something. And what would you do, Blitz? If a guy says you got to blow me to completion, but here's but I'll give you ten million. Mm, I'd, be I on mean, my, I'd be on my knees. I'd be like, you know what? I'm only doing it one time. Right. Yeah. Like what the fuck? Hey, Bubba, I heard you uh, blew a guy. I mm-hmm. would actually, actually, as I was doing it, I'd be on my cell phone on Zillow looking for a fucking nice mansion. Yeah. To buy. <laughs> No, I'd be on my I'd be hands. on my phone with fucking Tom B and saying, Tom, we're back, bitch. <laughs> Bubba, how, what happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tom, on to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Tom Bean's office. Bubba, hey. I can't hear you with that cock in your mouth. Tom, we're gonna be back <laughs> on top, bitch. And Tom said, Why are you calling me? You're the one that's blown me. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. I'm standing right here, Bubba. Why are you calling me on the phone? <laughs> Bubba, you're blowing me. Why are you calling me? <laughs> I would do. I know that I'm irresponsible. I've gotten better with money. But I would do. Like, Todd, are you over there? If I got $10 million, <laughs> if I got $10 million, okay? If I got $10 million, I would do, like, this February, a Lucas, like, Hundred thousand to win late model race, um, and I mean, wouldn't you have like Tyler? Wouldn't you have like the like a hundred cars there? Oh yeah, probably. Yeah. Would there be any chance of making money on it? No. No. No, I'm not in. I'm not making ten million to make money. I'm I'm getting ten million to have fun. I can't blow through ten million my last fifteen. Well, the fuck <laughs> I can. What can't. the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> ten million? Like okay. That's a million, lot, but it's not that much. It tells me it's a lot of money, but when you start spending it, man, it's going to go quick. Yeah. Well, first of all, just like Hogan said, if you got $10 million, you really only got five. Yeah. Well, let's say you got 10 free and clear. If like you got no 10 free and clear. Yeah, if you got 10 free and clear, you have to be a fucking absolute buffoon. Yeah, but not Bubba, to, to, but, oh. but Bubba, <laughs> what? fucking invest half that shit. Yeah. Don't be fucking doing races <laughs> and shit. Can man, you come listen on. to Kevin this time around? Put that shit in like fucking Bitcoin. Oh, no, I'm looking at shit. Real estate. Can you buy me some gears? <laughs> yeah, he needs a new bucket. Tyler, if I got ten million, we're fucking getting. We're calling Mark Richards, and we're getting two brand new XR ones, and I'm getting a brand new fifty one fifty, and I'm getting a fucking you know a, a couple of fucking Longhorn modifieds and a couple J and J four tens, buddy. Blitz, I know it's 2024, but I'm broke, cuz. I don't know what I did with my money. Blitz, I got $10 million on 2022, and I am i can't even pay the taxes on it it's anymore. It's 2024. I need to sell this shit, because I got no money. <laughs> <laughs> you I know got how $10 cool, million was a lot of money. Do you know how but, cool it used to be when I would go to fucking Stingray Chevy, and Heather wanted a new Escalade, mm-hmm. and I went and put my American Express black card down on the bitch and paid for it so cash right there. I can take it. And then as you were there, they give you one fucking for free to drive. Yeah, uh, Bubba, it's uh, sixty eight thousand nine hundred dollars. Well, you know what? Just put it on my black card. I got miles. I got points. I got points. As it hits the table, ting ting. Now I can't even fucking finance a milkshake. My sister had a co-sign for me. Bubba, your bill's sixty eight dollars. Well, hold on. Can you put twenty on this card? <laughs> I got twenty dollars cash and put the other the rest of yeah, the balance on this card. And then Tara's gonna come by tomorrow and lay yeah. down the rest. Okay. Do you guys do IOUs? 
I'm good for it. I'll be. I got to tell you, man. Almost 300 clicks over on Facebook, and it really, really. 607 six, on yeah, YouTube. 600 on YouTube. Six, yeah, it's been a great show. I think it's my new look. It, it is. is. It's, it the, is. Hair. Mm-hmm. it's the Jim Clooney. Jim Clem. Clem Jim. Jim Clem Clooney. Um, I think, I think, I think, I think it would be a great time to say goodbye. Oh, Anna, no. Listen, yeah. we can't get into all my shit. We got to get into your shit. We can go long today. Oh, I don't yeah, have I'm anything good. to do. I'm good to go long. What about your, what about your vaccination? So you're oh. scheduled to go to a wedding. Not like, scheduled for <laughs> anything anymore, but. Well, no, hold on. The plan was, yeah. Bubba Bay, you I didn't have a piece you... of my chicken, just half of it. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Not half, whole. I'm going to talk about her shit, okay? So you just go ahead and munch away, kid. Can I go grab something to drink? Yeah, you go too. I'll be right back. I'll Everybody be right back. just <laughs> abandoned me. This is me and old girl. Yeah, I love her. It's me and you. All right, so listen. Um, <clears throat> you don't even have, you didn't even buy your airline tickets? No, because I was waiting. F- so originally, the bride said that I had to be vaccinated. Brad Cruz, a thousand stars, Facebook. And I said, can I just give you a negative test? And she was like, oh, that didn't even occur to me. Yeah, that's fine. That's what she said. She did. Okay. She was cool. She gave me options. She's like, at first, she kind of said vax or antibodies. And then I said, how about just a negative test, Willie? And she said, you know, that sounds good. So she's good for it. She's cool. So then I was. So you're like, okay. I was waiting to get in touch with her to see her comfort level. And then I told her. And hers was cool. She was fucking cool. Right. So. She hot. She actually is very hot. Right. She likes to fuck. Like the opposite of your type, and she's like very light skin, blonde hair, blue eyes, but pretty girl. I like. That's I can, my type. Yeah, I can, it's Blitz's type. I, I, you know, I, I, I don't. I think I've only dated one blonde in my entire life. Nine ninety nine, the Bubba Light YouTube. Let's see if I can find her. Hi, Bubba Light. But you know, I, 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 I would maybe go out with a blonde. Maybe. Yeah, she's very cute. We were very close in high school. Okay. Or in uh, college. So she's cool with it, and I confirm with my mom, hey, these are the dates. I'm going to book the flight. And Sister Girl is cool with, you know. Jackie's cool with, with it. With me being a, having a negative test, Willie. Yeah. And now, mind you, I must backfill this in the fact that you haven't seen your mom for quite a while, like two years, Two years right? in November. <clears throat> right, and you and your mom are close. Like, you and your mom are close. You uh, love her. Yes, we're getting closer, but we, right. we had a, a strenuous relationship I, for about a year. I know, but you guys, you guys are, you know. We're getting, on good terms and right. we're getting closer. So, so you tell her, hey, sister girl, you know, it, it's cool. Yep. And I'm fixing to, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to buy my flight. Buy my flight. Today or tomorrow or something. And my mom said, uh, hold up, wait a minute. And I said, what? Now, how old is your mom? 63. See, that's the problem. I and she had it. open heart surgery. Okay. Which really means nothing. Um, no, well, what I'm just saying, like, Everybody that's had any kind of surgery automatically rolls it into a COVID deal. You know well, what I'm saying? It's it's a heart thing and comorbidity. Yeah, I mean she, risk factor. Her, right. She had major surgery. The heart has been stressed, and my mom chronically has had bad cases of respiratory issues. She has asthma, and my mom said at the last forty years of her life, thirty nine of them, she's had pneumonia once a year. Like she gets pneumonia very easily. Alopecia. Well, that's not related. But. All right. <clears throat> so Dick. you tell her, oh, girl's cool. I'm going to book my flight. Mama says, hierarchy, $65, $50, kids ass Thank on you. YouTube. Thank you, buddy. Thank you so much. And so she's like, hold on, sister girl. I would feel better if you get vaccinated. No, she said, let me just talk to my doctor. And I go, oh, fuck. So you got some Her fucking cardiologist. Based no, yeah, some so shitty she has like the primary care guy and the fucking cardiologist. And they all fucking hate Florida. And, yeah, they, one, they hate Florida. And two, they're fucking from California. And three, they literally have. Now, you know, of course, this is a this is a thing. And this is you know, a major deal. But they are absolutely flipped the fuck out in California. Over. Totally fucking And their media out. has flipped them the fuck out. Mm-hmm. Like, it's just flip and out. And their political uh, affiliations and, you know, all right. that bullshit, unfortunately. Right. It's the blue, it is arguably the first or second bluest state in, the, in America. Easily, yeah. Right. And even though my mom lives in a very, in a conservative enclave of california it's still pr- very blue right so my mom much like the balls that you leave most men correct right, blue balls. so 
My mom gets back to me like a week after that because it took her a while to get a hold of her doctors. And one of them felt the need to call her and basically warn her about people from Florida, about how irresponsible. Kind of motherfucking you a little bit. Oh, there's no question. A little bit. Backside motherfucker. He fucking threw under the bus. Under the bus, reversed, and then reversed back again. It was terrible. So he basically just said... That bitch needs to get the vaccine, otherwise it's a no-go. And my mom asked, because I had offered to get an antibody test, and she said that, and the doctor said, uh, quote, antibody, proof of antibodies isn't proof of immunity. Oh. Much like the vaccine. So you're getting just absolutely hated I'm on. I'm getting butt-fucked. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. Wow. Not in a good way. No. My butthole's but, tight, but and I don't like it. Butt-fucked's usually not it, you know, not... I, I don't want to be butt-fucked. Right, like... Not everybody, I'm most thinking. people are not into that. Yeah, I'm not. I don't want it. Yeah. So she gets back to you a week later and she says, I, what? <clears throat> I'd like for you to, I've talked to my doctors, A through Z. Yeah. They're flipped the fuck out. All people from Florida are white trash. You guys are going crazy out there. Yeah. Literally, COVID is like, you know, she just killing everybody. There's like <clears throat> their wheel bearing bodies through the streets. Right, right. Like, that's what other people's perception of Florida is. And I said, Mom, then why are so many fucking people moving here? And she's like, Well, I do know people moving there. I'm like, If it was so bad, why would everybody wanting, would, would want to leave California, New York, and come mm -hmm. to Texas and Florida? Right. But that, she, right. yeah. That's another, that's another deal. So, yeah. so go ahead. So. She, you know, we kind of left it a, at a standstill. This was last week, and she said, I'll get back to you, like, tomorrow. Bitch doesn't call me at all. She was ghosting me. I've been ghosted by a lot of men in my life, but I've never been ghosted by my mother. It was a weird flex. Oh, I have. It's 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 horrible. I didn't like it. <clears throat> I'm getting ghosted right now. <clears throat> yeah, so I, I call her on Tuesday, and um, I was like, are you avoiding me? And at least she was honest. She was like, yeah, kind of. <laughs> no, I like it. <laughs> okay. And did you, did you say... I said, did you... Because she would, talked it over with her husband, and she just said, listen, Anna, I get it. I get where you're coming from. I, I'm never going to tell you how to live your life if you want to walk around without a mask and, you know, be in crowds of people and blah, blah. But she said, I don't feel comfortable but with it. But they have a big misconception on how... On COVID in Florida. Like, they think that everybody's got COVID and we're just spreading it amongst yeah. all of us. And I said, Mom, it doesn't matter if I'm running around massless. If I'm healthy and I'm fine and I'm not sick, then, like, it doesn't matter how many people you fuck as long as you don't have syphilis at the end of the day, right? Like, yeah. you're still clean. It doesn't right. matter how many people you fucked. So, as long as you don't got to herps. Exactly. You're good to go. I mean, but, you know, you get you, you fuck too many and you get to herps. Well, then it's game changer. Yeah, yeah. But at this but point, you ain't I'm got, good. But it ain't, you ain't got no, to herps. I sneezed like two, one too many times. I took a COVID test. I was fine. Right. David F. And, a thousand stars. Facebook. And, and if you were going to go, you were going to be able to do your antibody levels and you have had, you've and you'd have a negative test ready for, you know, a rapid yeah, but, test ready. But, but a rapid test isn't good enough for her. She wanted the PCR. Okay. So, but that takes a couple days. All right. So, so then that would fuck it up. So did she say, I would like for you to get vaccinated? Yeah. She's like, can you do it for me? And I said, I don't negotiate. Oh, this negotiate. sounds familiar, Blitz, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And I said, I don't negotiate with terrorists. You didn't say that to her. I Jokingly, but, you know, to, just kidding. But also it felt like I was getting backed into a corner to do something I didn't want to do mm. at all. So now I really just Boy, don't know what to do. Uh, Janie Cake should really not think I'm as big a dick as I am. I mean, you know, because I just went ahead and got it for poor little Janie Cakes. Yeah. I didn't say I don't negotiate with terrorists. Yeah, or none but of that you were as against it as Anna has been. Yeah, and I, I get. It. I'm gonna say like I don't. I don't want to get it. I, plan, I don't ever plan on getting it. So I, I understand. Yeah. So I'm like, Mom, what's <laughs> listen. The I didn't want to get it, Blitz. I didn't want to get it, but I had everybody greasing me for it. You know. Yeah. So anyway. Where do we where where are where do you stand? I don't know. I just kind of left it at. You want me I'll to call think her about it? Oh, I don't know if she's gonna like <laughs> that. Like Mama Hummel, it's Bubba. She's probably listening right now. <clears throat> oh, she does. She listen. She does sometimes. Yeah. She David, I, did you miss? She the, thought I had a bald spot. She called it. me. Did you say the the big buck one that just came through yeah. that wants to qualify for it? With 100,000 stars on Facebook? The answer is no. You missed it until I reminded it to you. That's the answer. Say it. Uh, that's the answer. Sorry, just it's on. Yes. David Buck Buck uh, Buck Buchanan Blitz will start adding up your totals. We'll see where you're at, kid. 
So Anna, she yeah. she does does she listen to the show sometimes? She does sometimes, yeah. Okay. And you know we're now widely distributed on Facebook and YouTube, so she's probably one of the hot bitches on, on Facebook right now. Probably. What's her What's her screen name? I mean, on Facebook it would just be her real name. I don't know if I want to give it out. Oh yeah, don't. Because the trolls. Yeah, the trolls. So her Twitch name is actually like Anna sucks three four nine seven. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck that. My house. daughter won't get a vaccine eight four six. Yeah. <laughs> so daughter's a bitch. <laughs> are you I don't know canceling the trip I never really I didn't book it yet but I was gonna I was gonna buy my ticket like three weeks ago but it just kept well, getting you, you know it upended. keeps getting higher and higher and higher the, you know that the... I know and my mom offered to pay for it initially she's like I'm so excited I can't wait to see you this is gonna be great and then she said something kind of that kind of fucking pissed me off she said if only you got COVID three months ago because then it would have been fine what so she, cause she's, someone told her, uh, maybe a doctor that, you know, your antibodies last at least three months, yeah, but then days. after that it like fades away possibly. So she was like, if you had it in June then, or July, it would have been fine. But, but because, because you got it in April, April, I was like, are you listening to yourself talk right now? Like if I got it two months later, it would have been fine. She's like, yeah, I would have been totally fine. I would have been like, book the flight. Oh my God. She is so misinformed. It's just like, what the fuck? So I don't know what to do. So I said, what's the resolution, Mom? Am I just never going to fucking see you again? Because this isn't going away anytime soon. And she just kind of was like, I don't know. I don't know. I have to look out for my health. I I said, okay. I mean, I respect that, but also like, fuck. Now, now, you went to California a year ago. December. And you were going to see her, but because of all the COVID stuff. She just had heart surgery. No, no, I know, but I'm yeah. saying you were there, but you didn't see her because of the COVID stuff. Yeah, you're she had have not heart. had COVID A, and B, she hadn't been vaccinated. You're going to have heart surgery, broken heart surgery. Oh. I already have. That really sucks. So I don't know what the fuck to do. I'm thinking about getting J&J and just, you know, getting it done, but... But I will oh, tell you this, man. J&J's hard to find. Is I, it? No. Rachel, Rachel got it. Uh, J and J is easy to find if you go in there and say, "Hey, I want a vaccine. Do you have J and J?" You it's, just walk in and say, and yeah, ask it's, for it. "Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to make an appointment for the J and J." But it's also not very effective. Well, that's fucking fine as long as it doesn't kill me. As long as you can say, "I got vaccinated," and here's my fucking paperwork, right? <sighs> that's but even, you know what? That's but even the, more sad. It, it, and, 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 and but but here's what sucks, Anna. Like this is truly something that you don't like. This I've, is almost, and I don't even want to like. Yeah. But this is like almost like Hitler like, is it not? Totally. No, and I'm not trying to be disrespectful no, to the Jewish no, faith. No, no, what no, I'm no. trying to say is like this is like a mandate that you have no fucking option on. Yeah, it's just total government totalitarian control. Not in the sense that it's like a genocide. I'm not right. saying that, but in terms of just but the control that Hitler had over his people. Right. And he had here's the thing, he got his own people to turn against each other and turn each other in, and that's exactly what's going on now. Yeah. And it's the, the Do you know how many families are disrupted by this? You know, because there's millions. you know, there's a guy like me that says, Okay, I'm pretty healthy. Um I've had it and uh, I have antibodies. But your older mother, you know, is like, please, please get it. Please. And then, and then you get it. And, and then the re- the, and one of the reasons why I got it is it's just so I can hang out with my family and I can't get blamed for when a motherfucker gets it. But mm-hmm. your your mom wasn't not going to see you if you didn't get it, right? Mm-hmm. Or did she say I'm not seeing you until well, you get hell, it? Well, hell, I should have never got it, Blitz, because I saw her more when I didn't have it yeah, than I do too. now. She's yeah. so fucking hot at me. Well, that's, I mean, that's a different issue, but. So I don't know what the fuck to do. My dad doesn't care. My dad's like, what? Da- you know what? Your dad's so much cooler than your mom. <laughs> My dad's just like, yeah, if you want to come here, whatever. It's cool. So can, now, do they live an hour your mom, apart? Your mom and dad live an hour apart. Yeah. How far does your dad live from the wedding? An hour and four minutes. Okay. <laughs> I looked it up. I know exactly what I would be doing. Staying with dad. Well, and- I mean, you have, you, have, you have a couple options. You can get it mm-hmm. and make your mom happy yeah. and maybe upset yourself yeah. or and it won't be anything you're, you're not gonna have strained your relationship with your mother or you cannot get it stay with your dad go to the wedding show her that you're negative but it's really gonna put a fucking like it's I just really don't know when i'm gonna see my mom maybe if... how, how about how about which could you do this could you talk to your mom and say hey look here's the deal i i'm gonna fly in i'm, I'm staying with dad as soon as I get there, I'm taking a PCR test. When I get the results, can I come see you? 
Like, would she be okay with that? I just don't think I'm going to have enough time. Like, I was thinking yeah, about flying in on a Wednesday and leaving a Sunday. Why don't, why don't, why don't, you, why don't I just give you more time off? Why don't you just fly in on Tuesday? I like, can do that. I, no, like, like need, for, you, like you for real, I'll work with you. Yeah. And, and if you need some more time off so that you can do that. Yeah, but but I don't know. I'm just going to be honest with you. I don't know if that will completely make her happy. I think it's it's one of those things where she knows that, like she knows that the PCR test we wouldn't have enough time. So she's just saying, oh, you know, if you got that and you quarant, because then it's going to be well, you have to quarantine for three days after. Yeah. So it's she's kind she of put you in, she's kind of put you in a trick bag. Well, yeah. Can you, can you? But here's the thing. Maybe I'll go back in December like I did last year when you give us that time off. Maybe I'll go for a week and then I'll have plenty of time yeah, but, to do whatever. But, but that's just going to make her, that's going to fill her head with even more flutters, a bunch of white banshees running around here. I mean, mm-hmm. like it's not going to get any better with her and how she regards where you live and your lifestyle from now until December. Like it's not going to, her opinion of Floridians yeah. are, are, is not going to change. She's not, she's not going to be happy until you get the vaccine. And I, I know you want to go to the wedding, but like a lot of the reason why you're going is to see your mom, not just to I go to the wedding. I would say it's about like 50-50, yeah. Sure. So I don't know what the fuck to do, because every did, time now, I did, think did, about now, getting it, I about, feel like I'm giving up. I know exactly how we can remedy this. Uh-oh. What has Kevin done? Kevin got the J&J. There, there you go. <laughs> I mean, he's been trying to get me to get the vaccine too. There, there you go. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I still no, don't want to get it. I, I still, I, yeah, see, I don't think I, that's a good I, answer. I'm just saying, your your life is everything, Kevin. But the but the yeah. so it's different. On a blitz, I mean, uh, uh, let me right true. everything, Kevin. That's true. I mean, you as you should, because I respect the guy. The guy is straight up fucking money. He's the salt of the earth. He's one of the smartest guys I know. He's one of the most calculated responsible, best husband, best father. Just he's just a really good guy. Would yeah, you would you not if, agree? If she was his age, I would say yes, but I don't, I mean, what would Kevin do? Instead of what would Jesus do? What would Kevin what do? What would Kevin do? J and J. Kevin says J and J. I'd be getting stuck J and J as soon as I can. I call my mom, mm-hmm. said, Mom, I'm fucking vaccinated and I'm coming to see you, Mama. Because you know what? You know how much you don't know how much longer you're gonna have with your mom. I know. I mean, you could have fifteen years, you could have five, you could have twenty. I mean, it's you just don't know. Bullshit. I just really, I it really is. don't it's, want it, to the get whole, it. The whole the whole Anna, the whole thing sucks. It's all bullshit. It's it's but it's 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 what we're going through right now, and you know it's. I don't know. I would try one more time and talk to her and see what anything you could do to to appease her and not get the vaccine. I'm thinking maybe I just come back to see her in December. I say, what would Kevin, Kevin do? do? WWKD. WWKD. Bitch. J and J. What does Kevin say? Go get the J and J. And be done with it. That would make my life easier. Yeah, until you grow a third arm out your back. Oh, I fuck. mean, yes, but potentially. But I mean, fuck. I could I mean, use she doesn't get hand. fucked with two arms. She might get fucked with three. Yeah, yeah. might be someone in. Poor there. little thing. Yeah, at least she could pat herself on the back now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she could burp herself. Yeah. So, but plus, it wouldn't be called a reach around if she already when, had a When there. will you make this decision, you think? <laughs> it's going to have to be pretty soon. The, the wedding. I think the, it's going to have to be like real soon. Yeah. The wedding's October 23rd. So, what is this? Well, listen, days? you know, you, if, 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 when booking airlines, you know, four weeks, you're still good. You start getting into the three and the two yep. week. Oh, I mean, expensive. it goes up. How about, how about, how about this? Would it make more sense to try? Because, if you book on a lot of websites now, you can get a full refund. Book now, and then if you decide to cancel, but if you the longer you wait, the more expensive. Yeah, but then it, it's also complicated because if I stay with my dad, I have to fly into a different airport. Okay, okay. Anna, not that I matter, not that you give a fuck. I'm not Bubba Koontz with a Joey B kicker and a Kevin Chaser. Joey B. Yeah, Joey B. <laughs> but the comedian. Mm-hmm. I would just get it. Fuck it. I threw my hands up in the air and got it. Don't you feel like you you? You were defeated. You yeah, gave up. But, but that happened back in 2012 when the sex tape came oh, out. Oh, so you're used to it. Like I'm already fucking defeated. I've conditioned myself for con- for for Speaking defeat. Speaking of which, Bubba, when are you going to get the second one? What do you mean? Well, you, I mean, you, you're 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 half vaxxed right now. When are you going to get the other shot? Monday. Okay. I've already got an appointment with Publix. Okay. 
I'm going in Monday because I'm going to be fucking running around the track and yeah. So, the tw- <coughs> so this Monday come up the twentieth. No, you know what? Actually, so I'll be hosting on Tuesday. No, no, hold on. Wednesday, I, Thursday, act- <laughs> I actually might go today. Oh, okay. I might go. This what if might- you? But you have bubble one ninety nine tomorrow. Do you want to risk it for feeling like shit? Content is king. Oh, okay. Hi, it's bubble one ninety nine. I'm having a reaction. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bell's palsy. Can you, can you, hey, it's bubble one ninety nine. Three eighteen. Travis says we're. Low on money tonight. Up, Cuzzy, Cuzzy. I'm gonna need a wheelchair. Cuzzy, we need some money, Cuzzy. A tractor and a wheelchair. I need a tractor, Cuzzy, and a wheelchair. Anna, let's see if you've paid attention. What type of tractor do I need? G one fourteen four twenty. A J fourteen. J fourteen. I need 20. a J fourteen four twenty. Yeah. No, you need I need a, a four wheel drive. Four wheel drive. How many horsepower, Lana? How many horsepower? Mm. The PTO needs to be how many horsepower? Yeah, four hundred. Yeah, four hundred would be great. Seventy five or above. That's four hundred, bitches. Well, Seventy five to a hundred. Four hundred horsepower PTO would fucking <laughs> twist everything in half. Yeah. Seventy five to a hundred, but rip it could be a entire, little bit. Rip up be... the entire track. <laughs> yeah, so that's what I'm looking for. I need it so very bad so I can race next wheel drive. So I can race next weekend. Horsepower. Please and thank you. I, you know what? Why don't you, why don't you go to Publix with me and get stuck, bitch? <laughs> I don't want to. Especially not Moderna. Froves. I got to poop. <laughs> we had a great show today, man. The, I'm just going to tell you right now. Here's the Iggy. The hot chicks hang out on Facebook. So does Big Buck. He's fucking rolling, Big Buck, is he not? <laughs> He's rolling. Um, thank you. And today, we almost took this thing till noon, did we not? Yep. Woo! Anna, yeah. I'll support whatever you do. Thank you. Including if you need a little more time off. Oh, that's very generous. Now, I Blitz, do that. we, if she doesn't go, do we take her to Fort Walton Beach? If we drive, yes. Does she get her own room? Uh, yeah. Anna, Woo! do you want your own room? Yes. Or do you want to stay with me, Blitz, or Dan? I want to stay with me. <laughs> Appreciate y'all. We'll see you tomorrow.